Here's the ultimate list of 80s music video vixens. And apart from liking this video and subscribing to our channel, let's just skip the BS and get right into the good stuff. Starting at number 10, Dale Bazio. She wasn't just a singer, she was an experience. Dale, the front woman of the new wave band called Missing Persons, was nothing short of extraordinary. With her wild wardrobe and striking makeup that screamed 80s, she was impossible to ignore. I mean, come on, who else could rock a fishbowl bra and rainbow hair like her? Coming in at number nine, Belinda Carlisle. Not just a go-go, but a go-getter. She took the world by storm, first as a lead singer of the all-female band The Go-Go's, and then as a successful solo artist. From We Got the Beat to Heaven is a Place on Earth, Carlisle's voice was the soundtrack of the 80s. Here's an interesting tidbit. Carlisle once auditioned for the role of Sarah Connor in the movie The Terminator. Can you imagine that? Number 8, Helena Christensen. A Danish-Peruvian beauty best known for her modeling career, Helena graced Chris Isaac's Wicked Game music video, Making Us All Swoon. That black and white video, the beach, the romantic tension, it's an unforgettable slice of music video history. And guess what? She's also a talented photographer who has had her own work featured in major magazines. At lucky number seven, we have Jenna Tomasino, or should I say Jenna Keo, known for her appearances in ZZ Top's Legs, Sharp Dressed Man, and Gimme All Your Loving. Basically, in those ZZ Top videos, Jenna was known as the first hot girl to get out of the cool car. And those three videos alone pretty much made her one of the quintessential 80s video vixens. She later gained more fame on Bravo's The Real Housewives of Orange County. Talk about a career change, huh? Sheila E. holds the number six spot. A top-notch drummer and a protege of Prince, she made waves with her solo career. In fact, you might remember her from her music video, The Glamorous Life. Fun fact, did you know she performed with legends like Marvin Gaye and Lionel Richie? Yeah, she's that cool. Cracking into the top five, Christy Brinkley the stunner in Billy Joel's Uptown Girl music video. Besides lighting up the music video scene, she was one of the most popular models of the 80s, and who can forget her cameos in National Lampoon's Vacation. At number four, Samantha Fox. She had a double hit career, successful singer and popular pinup model. Fox's Touch Me, I Want Your Body music video was nothing short of iconic. Oh, and did you know she once managed a female football team in England? Talk about versatility. Paula Abdul is straight up at number three. The straight up singer and choreographer was a tour de force in the music industry. Her dance routines were killer and her videos were always a delight. Did you know that she started her career as a cheerleader for the LA Lakers? Runner up at number two, Tawny Katane. Tawny, known for her wild hair flips and acrobats on two Jaguars in White Snake's Here I Go Again video, Katane was the epitome of rock and roll vixen. And she also starred in the movie Bachelor Party, alongside Tom Hanks. Finally, at the number one spot, Susanna Hoffs, the lead vocalist of The Bangles. Hoffs was a staple of 80s music videos, from Manic Monday to Walk Like an Egyptian, she was everywhere. She even made her way to the silver screen, starring in The All Nighter. Now that's a star. Well, there you have it, my perspective on the top 10 music vixens of the 80s. Now, apart from liking this video and subscribing to our channel, let's just skip the BS and the pleasantries and dive straight into it. Do you think I missed the mark? Where did I screw up? Light up the comments, prove me wrong, I dare you, bring it on, I want to hear from you.